Welcome back everybody, my name is Eltamar and we are going to be continuing our let's play of Legend of Grimrock 2 Where we left off last time, I was just killing off the rats because we didn't save um, And now we're actually going to explore this water really quickly Because I accidentally fell into this when I was uh, killing the rats So in the water, there is a robe and a staff A diviner's robe and a shaman's staff so, energy plus 25, vitality plus 2 is going to replace his crappy staff that he's currently using, and his cloak is going to be this diviner's cloak, which gives him more energy regeneration. There's probably more stuff in the water, so I'm going to go take a quick look around, just to make sure that we don't miss anything. Here we go. Nothing down this path. One thing to note about water is you got to be careful not to drown. Although, really, it doesn't look that deep. You could literally just probably jump up and be like, hey. Well, let's go grab. There's a ladder here, which is good. Grab that ingredient, whatever it is. Back down into the water. There's some sort of sack to grab. There's also something else over there, but I'm going to get out of the water before I drown. Oh god, I'm gonna drown. There's the ladder. Okay, we're gonna try that again, but we're gonna actually go down that secret area thing. And if I were to go here... Ooh, that's close. Good. What's over here? A ladder. Where does it go, though? A secret area? Huh. There's some fishies in the water. Some bars. What's inside the bars? Looks like there's something inside the bars. Okay, how do we get to them now? Must be a button or something around? Let's go find a button. Probably around the perimeter of the room somewhere, if I were to hazard a guess. Could be wrong, of course, but... Maybe I am wrong. Hmm... Oh, well, there's got to be a way in. Actually, I actually have an idea. I don't know if this will work. I don't know if I'm going to get stuck if I do this, but let's try it out. Oh, I can't cast spells underwater. Hmm, there goes that hope. Yeah, I was hoping to cast that under the water so I could walk across the top of it, but... That doesn't appear to be the case. There's a button under the water right to press. Radicus is hungry, so we'll he will give him some food in a second here. Not seeing any but oh there's a key. A key slot. Do we have any keys lying around? I don't think so. So we're gonna have to come back for that or find the key. Is there a key lying around up here? There's a lockpick. I was so busy looking for buttons that I wasn't paying attention to what's on the ground. Hmm. Not seeing any keys though, unfortunately, unless it's underground or in the water. Let's go take a look around under here. If you notice anything glowy, let me know. No, oh, it's any keys. Unfortunate. At least we got more lockpicks. I didn't actually mean to go in there. Hmm. 
Alright, no keys that I can see. Guess we'll head back out. For now, if we find a key, we'll, uh... Do more exploring, but... For now... We're SOL on the key front. We need to get out of the water pretty quick. We're gonna start to drown. Oops, shit. There we go. Alright, we're looking for a gold key at some point in here. Sewer exit west. I think this is... Is this where we ran into that monstrous rat thing? Because that thing was relatively terrifying. Uh, let's give him some food, because he's hungry. There you go. I think this is different. Yes, this is something completely different. Um, Jesus! Holy crap, what the hell was that? He just killed one of my characters in like, a second. Fucking leprechauns, man. They think they're so smart with their deadly fire bombs, which are actually quite deadly, admittedly. This thing takes a long time to load, actually. Alright. Let's try that again. I thought I saw something on the ground, but I guess not. Where'd he go? You dirty bastard. Why are you so incredibly fast? I have you trapped now. Just stay still and die. Holy crap. He just flat out killed Radicus. And like half my group. Alright, the way to fight gnomes is not to- or Leprechauns is not to trap them in the corner. Also, they have a ton of hit points. the hell was that? Alright, let's try this again. That is not cool. <laughs> Actually, that's kind of cool, I'm not going to lie. It's pretty fantastic. He is very powerful. Like, those bombs hurt a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Also, it takes a very... Like, this game's quick load is not quick. Not really, anyways. Um, who has room in their inventory for this shield? So Radicus does. That way I don't slow down my group. We're gonna be very careful fighting this dude this time. Come on. There we go, he's gone. Also, that key. Now we have the key for that thing, I think. We can go back and get that secret. Or we have the key to get out of the room. Go figure. But we did get a meteor shield, which sounds kind of cool. What does a meteor shield do? Who got it? You do. Evasion 7, resist fire 10. That's awesome. There we go. His, res his uh, evasion is now a mere negative 13. Wow, that hurt. But it wasn't deadly, just hurt a lot. There's another one over there. They're just suiciders, I understand, okay. How do I stop those things? Cause they hurt a lot. Maybe we have to like, I don't think a fireball is gonna do a lot against them. Hmm.
slow loading screen. Very slow loading screen. I should add. All right, so that's gonna open up. It's gonna bring one of these dudes out. You just stay right there. Oh, there's more of them. Ow. Greater healing potion. Oh, damn. Oops. Let's try not to die from this incoming attack. I don't think we're going to have much of a choice but to take it. Alright, bring it on. Okay, that hurt. But, we're more or less okay. There's another one. Shit. I don't think we can survive another one. Uh, do we have any healing potions kicking around? No, but we can make some. I suppose. Okay, let's make one. Where to put my stuff? Wrong character. That would be where I put my stuff. It's on the other character. And we're gonna need to. Oh crap. Ooh, oh, damn it. That's gonna suck. My mouse got stuck and did not do my wall thing properly. Alright, let's go find a. Sh like a regeneration station crystal. There's gotta be one around, right? Yeah. So we go this way, and then we go that way, that way, that way, that way. Okay. Well, let's go heal up. I'm hoping that's all of the fire elemental blasty things that are going to be around today. Because they hurt. Like, a lot. Hoping it's back up already, but it might not. Oh, there it is. Cool. Back to life, ready to roll. You know what? What is over here? Just a door that I can't open, okay. What's over here? Because on the map it shows it being- oh, it's just a- okay. So that's how we can go up, we don't want to do that yet. We're still exploring the sewers, which are quite extensive actually. There's another one of those phoenix things. Those things suck. Do I have any spells that can deal with them? Maybe. Let's take a quick look at our spell lists. Darkness, light, doesn't help. Ice shards. We don't have water or earth magic. Shock shield doesn't really help us. Poison bolt. We don't have earth magic. Shock, not super useful. Shield. Kinda useful. Uh, force field is awesome. But not super helpful in this case and poison cloud might actually we can probably poison cloud and just like wander through it and hope it dies it's worth a shot i guess ranged weapons are kind of needed in the game well i'm taking your mushroom i may not be able to get to you but the mushroom is mine so we have a bunch of ways we can go we can go here which i think is where we are going to go place is scary. There are a lot of mean creatures in here. This is the area with the boss guy. And this is gonna suck. Let's get out of there. Uh, we don't want to be trapped in a corner. We definitely don't want to be trapped in this corner. There's a lot of rat friends with him. Okay. I 
Ow. Come on, die. Please die. Holy shit, that thing hurts. I think I might die. Why are your spells fizzling? Oh, because... Yeah, that's the end of that fight. He got head damage, so he wasn't casting spells properly. Okay, how do I want to do this? I think we have to kill all the little ratlings first. So we can dodge the big guy. But... There's a whole lot of little rattlings. And we don't want to fight the big guy face to face. We want to be able to dodge around his attacks. That's a good kit. Damn. We'll just stay away from the big guy for now. Oh shit, oh shit, I'm like super surrounded now. Come on, die. Hello, cannon dude. It actually literally shot me to the side. Jesus Christ. Okay. I think we only have the big guy left. He is fucking scary as shit though. And he fires so fast. Okay, this is how I'm gonna do this fight. Oh shit, oh. Fuck, I can hit the wrong button. This has gone very bad very quickly. Come on. Well, this might take longer than anticipated. Shit. Too soon on that one. Anyone else got some energy potions kicking around? There's a lot of light. I will very slowly kill him. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, that was close. I'm pretty sure one hit from the cannon will kill this character. That doesn't help at all. Like, I'm just like throwing all of them. Whew. Okay. T 
tough fight. Deadly opponent. Hits like a train. Like 100 plus damage a hit. I need a healing thing pretty soon. Lots of cheese. I like cheese. And some sort of letter. You deserve some cheese for your fighting efforts. What's the letter say? Do not disturb. Thanks. Leather brigandine? Brigandine? Whatever. It's better than hers. I don't think she can- oh, she can put it on out of combat. Or even when she's a corpse. I guess my mage just kind of like propped her up. Took off her old armor. And just uh, shoved her in some new armor. It's not super weird and creepy at all. Potion of Vitality. Excellent. I'm actually going to give that to um, her when she's alive. Because she needs it more. And we have a cannon. A hand cannon. If it requires firearms of four, does a ton of damage. Maybe I should make him a cannoneer eventually. Sounds kind of cool, actually. We have two brass keys. I'm not sure what either of them are for, but... I'm guessing one is to get out of this room, which we are officially locked in. I don't see any lock things, though, anywhere. Maybe we should quick save before we go anywhere because we only have one character left. And if we die, it's all over. It's game over, man. Game over. We're actually at 22 minutes. I'm going to end the video here, find my way out of the room. And then in the next video, we'll continue our exploration. Like always, if you need suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time.